And as soon as Wayne White gets on the microphone, you know you're about to witness something special. He's the voice you'll hear this week at the Oregon Horse Center. Tonight was no different as the Eugene Pro Rodeo returned for its 28th year. It was tough enough to wear pink night in support of the Oregon Cancer Foundation. Everyone was rocking pink, even this guy, Jacob Lee, is one of the riders from Pismo Beach, California. Look at him on the bareback riding. It's exactly why I don't do the rodeo. He ended with a high score of 79.5. And how about some more events, some calf roping. Justin Smith of Leesville, Louisiana, took down this calf in a quick time of 8.8 .8 seconds. But if you thought that was good, watch this. KZI competed in an inflatable bouncing horse race challenge. We had to go from one end to the other. There's our very own chief meteorologist, Marissa Wolzen, in the middle right there, getting us off to a good start. There I was right there, leg day for me. And then I pass it off to news reporter Emma Jerome. She wanted her credit. She's going to get it right now. Watch this. She's in the final stretch, but then loses control of the horse. But of course, it's not how many times you fall. It's about how many times you get back up. And she was our anchor and finished off the victory. But then watch, watch this. She got a little bit mad at her horse right there, but still first place for KEZI. And I think we should stick to the inflatable bouncing horses uh, as we were all winded there at the end of the race, rather than uh, the actual rodeo, keep that to the pro to the professionals. But a lot of exciting stuff happening at the Eugene Pro Rodeo this week, and we'll have coverage of that one right here on KZI Nine News.